Yo, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another I Feel a Filmmaker vlog. And right now, I'm driving. It's pretty late right now. This isn't gonna be that long of a vlog. Uh, my boy, Mr. Fab, he was doing a podcast with I Am Sue. He's a Bay Area rapper, if you don't know who he is. He has a lot of big songs and all that. And uh, I was just playing basketball, and right when I got done, Fab, he texted me. And he was like, yo, I'm doing a uh, podcast with Sue. And he should come through and get some footage. So that's where I'm on the way to right now and uh he's doing it in oakland i live in fremont so that's about like 25 30 minutes away so yeah i'm just on the way there and this probably isn't gonna be that long of a, sh of a video or a vlog because i'm imagining there's not that much that we're gonna be able to do inside like this small studio so i'm just gonna get a couple of shots probably put them together actually i think i might put them together with i was with fab the other day with too short I was kind of doing the same thing, like just getting some footage, behind the scenes type stuff, uh, doing, them doing a podcast, a little studio session, and I might just put that inside here too, because uh, I don't know what, what else to do with it, it's not really too much to do with it, so I'll probably just combine them in the same video, I'm probably about to pull up to the studio in just a minute, I'm about, about to get off the freeway right now, and uh, yeah, so that footage is coming to you right now. talking with T-Pain one day mm -hmm. and we were talking and he said that he had an opportunity to uh, to go to Michael Jackson's house before he passed. Wow. And and they were talking and he was like, I asked Michael Jackson, he was like, man, I, it was at one point in my life where I asked Mike at, at what stage did you feel like you made it? Mm -hmm. And he said, Mike's response to him blew his mind away. He said, I never felt like I made it. I just, wow. He was like, I just was doing music. He was just doing it. <laughs> so it, so when you just said, I just kept my head down, man, not paying attention to the scoreboard, when you finally look up, you realize how many points you've put up. And, yeah. and that that's a, that was yeah. a great analogy, man. That's crazy, um, bro. I will tap the video, too. I need you on that. Come to the shop. Come to the air. That'll be dope. For real, I will. That'll All right, my dope. guy. What's up, bro? Good seeing you. He shoot videos and shit too, bro. I like, know him. Goes, I know okay, him. Yeah. Okay. He shot a video where I almost broke my foot. He almost <laughs> yeah, broke my so foot on a skateboard. <laughs> baby. baby. You was getting busy. Hope you all enjoyed that footage right there. Uh, it was a cool podcast. Make sure you stay tuned for it. I put a little uh, snippet of it in there. So yeah, that's uh, Mr. Fab. He's coming out with a lot of podcasts and he's doing a bunch of stuff with uh, a lot of big people like Draymond Green. I know you got the Too Short one. I'm about to show you some footage from that in just a second. I think I think he said he's getting Steph Curry on there too. And so he has a lot of interviews coming up pretty soon. So make sure to stay tuned with that. So yeah, I'm gonna put in the Too Short footage in just a second. So, so you guys can peep that out. This isn't really a vlog. It's kind of the other day. Uh, I didn't put it in a vlog or anything like that just because it was like a pretty quick studio session, like 45 minutes or something like that. And we were just chilling around the studio. In short, was spinning some game, just like being the OG that he is. When an OG speaks, you usually just want to sit and listen and just soak in the game. You feel me? So yeah, this is some of the footage from the short podcast. Uh, they just, they put it together like it was, it was, it was like Cam they, and they them. Play, they played they play Jay. All the, the shit that Jay took. took. Yeah, All they, the shit that Jay took. But it's like, niggas, so? He just had a style of uh, sound bite niggas. He just hella sound bites from Jay. Oh, 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 Drake do it. Nick, every, every nigga, if you want to be great in life, you have to take from everything. There's no nigga that's ever funny, been. The funny shit is, nigga, just said that we Listen. How you, how you, just, we just what? said that. That you like a kung fu master or some shit. Yeah, if, you style, style. Style. if you <laughs> never, right, my nigga, if you never, if if you don't have a desire to be great, yeah. then you can be settled for being good. Now, good will just get you the, you know, you're good. Yeah. You you when 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 the greats talk about who's good, they'll always mention you. Yeah. Always, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they'll always say, you know what I'm saying? They'll always be like, oh, nigga's good. The great greats talk about who's good. When Michael Jordan, <laughs> listen. The rapper, you got a choice for you, like. Be like the young days, man. The young days, it was, it was, it wasn't even thinking who am I gonna be like. It was like, 
I gotta find a lane. I can't be like nobody. Exactly. I'm, you gotta look at everything that's out there and go, I gotta do something else other than everything that's out there. I think I'm so rough. <laughs> Alright. was picking at. I just had to stop in my bank real quick. I was just thinking, like, because that's not the first time me and I'm Sue have met. I've done, like, three, four videos for him, like, music videos. We did our first video back in, like, it was, like, 2012 or 2011 or something like that. I was still in high school. And uh, it was for the Slow Down remix with Clyde Carson. It was Clyde Carson, Sue, um, Cool John, and Skip. I did the video with me, uh, my boy Adrian Purr, and uh, that video was like probably one of the first big videos that I did, and it got like a good amount of recognition out in the, out here in the Bay, and it opened up a lot of opportunities for me too, because people saw that I did that video, or me and Adrian, and they hit me up saying like, oh, I saw the video you did with with Sue and Clyde Carson and all that, it was sick, like, I want to work with you and all that, and I got a lot of connections from that video. I was just kind of just thinking that how crazy it is, how far Seuss came as an artist and just how he's made a career for himself out of this music stuff. Like not too many people could do that. And uh, how far he's come, all the people that he's worked with, some major A-list people. So shouts out to I Am Sue. He's one of the biggest Bay Area rappers that there's ever been really. Hope y'all like that footage. Yeah, I'm just, I'm on the way back right now from the, from the I Am Sue podcast, so just driving down 880 right now about to be home probably about like 10 15 minutes hope you guys enjoyed the footage that i just showed you guys just like a little insight of the bay area rap life or the bay area rap scene both uh podcasts came out real cool make sure to stay tuned for those and make sure to subscribe to the youtube channel make sure you like share the videos do all that good stuff but yeah i hope you all have a good night or good day whenever you're seeing this it's night where i'm at right now 